Oh man. Oh man. Oh god. Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and if you're new here make sure you subscribe and if you're returning then thank you for returning i guess but uh so today modern warfare came out as you can see it literally just came out like what about an hour ago so i wanted to show you the absolute best class setup that i've found so far and so yeah let's just hop into it i'm just gonna i'm gonna do it real quick um because i'm ready to play but the m4a1 that's it that's the gun that i've been using and all the attachments on it you can go and customize this yourself but what i've had that's worked good for me so far is the barrel i use this the corvus custom marksman gives you more damage range bullet velocity recoil control and then i'm, I'm not going to go through all the negatives and stuff because i'm just trying to make this real quick um so this site right here this is really just all preference on the site the site really doesn't matter too much but i really like this site because it's small so it like stays out of your way but also aims in just right i also like the hollow site a lot but so far the reflex site has been the best for me i don't put a laser on because i don't really see much purpose in it i don't hit fire that much um a stock i wanted to put on but i didn't have enough space because you only get five attachments that you can put on so uh for the perk i went for more money because you get xp more xp for kills and right now i'm just wanting to level up as fast as i can like as fast as above i possibly can right now so there's that and then rear grip i mean it really didn't matter too much on that so i didn't care ammo i put this last one here it has pretty cool little design on the mag but uh yeah, there's that. I'm just hovering over it. I'm not going to say all of that one. That's too long. But um, it gives the pros are plus damage and plus range. The cons is less fire rate, less aiming recoil control, and less magazine ammo capacity. But, I mean, it's, it's worked pretty well so far. So, I don't, I don't see the problem with that one. Um, and then for the underbarrel here, I got the Ranger foregrip and that has more recoil control and aiming stability less aim walking movement speed and aim down sight speed but i mean those really don't affect me too much because i'm whenever i see someone i aim and shoot them you know i don't i don't sit there and just walk while aiming or something it doesn't matter that much but uh so yeah there's the setup for that for my secondary i picked the deagle here because I used that in the alpha and the beta and it was super nice so I just put a muzzle break on the muzzle for the barrel I put this one the attack enforcer um, no laser side because you don't need that and optic you could put it on there and switch it out for like the mo money perk but I really just want as much XP as possible and um, for the tape, the grip tape, I put stippled grip tape, faster aim down sight speed, uh, faster sprint to fire speed, and then less aiming stability. But I mean, it's a pistol, you don't really need aiming stability that much. Uh, ammunition, I didn't even bother because it just gives you a higher ammo capacity, and I don't use my pistol that much, so I didn't see the purpose. And then for the trigger, I put match grade trigger. Gives you faster fire rate and aiming stability, which I mean, I didn't care about too much. And less hit fire accuracy. And I mean, it's a pistol, so I'm not really gonna be hit firing much with it. And then as for the perks, I want this to kind of be a run and gun type of class, but also be able to like sit back and shoot people if I see them from a distance. So for the class part, I made it where you can like shoot them from a distance and not worry about it. And for the perks, I made it where you can like rush in and also use it for a rushing class. So for perk one, I put double time, double duration, a tactical sprint, increased crouch movement speed by 30%. So you can just pretty much run and gun everywhere you go. Um, perk two, I put hardline. Your kill streaks cause one less kill. And that's just because none of these really sounded good to me, like none of these other ones. So might as well get your kill streak a lot quicker. Um, amped. 
faster weapon swap and rocket launcher speed again none of the other ones sounded too good and i mean if you really are running and gunning then you can like shoot someone if you like shoot multiple enemies run out of ammo then you can just switch over to your pistol real quick so it, it helps you survive longer um for lethal put frag grenade i also thought about the c4 but i haven't really tried the c4 yet so i'll see about that so i'd go with either frag grenade or c4 in your class um for tactical the snapshot grenade which i mean whenever it explodes near an enemy it shows like where they are it's so, like i'll show you this little video real quick it shows what it does So whenever it explodes by an enemy, it like lights them up like vision poles, pretty much. So you can see them through the walls and crap. So you can just chunk that over a wall and see if like a whole team is standing there. So it's pretty helpful. And yeah, that's pretty much the only class I got so far. The SMG um, that I wanted to show, where is it? The MP7, the MP7 is definitely one of the best SMGs. That's another class you could use, but for right now, I'm going with the M4A1. It's one of my favorites, so. Put the 60 round mag on. Screw that other one. Yeah, what are you using? M4. Oh, well, that was a headshot. Oh my god, oh my god, my aim is eight. <laughs> How can you see it through the smoke? Oh my god, my aim is just absolutely terrible. I'm a god at the deagle though. Ooh, grab. I'm out of ammo. Oh man. Oh man, oh god, that's a teammate. Ooh, the headshot for the win. Killing these bots like it's doing nothing. 32 kills, I so mad. Oh, they have played the game again, bro. Looks nice. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure you subscribe because I'll be posting a lot more Modern Warfare content and some Borderlands 3 content every once in a while, but I'll be playing the crap out of this game. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.